Hello everyone. I'm Vasilios Lourdes, leader of the KNX Association Tools team, manager of the KNX software development. I'm very excited to share with you some information about our newest member in our software family, which is ETS Inside, and to give you some more insights about it. So, ETS Inside is a revolutionary tool by KNX Association that runs on any existing or new KNX installation. You shall see it as the entry level version of your trusted ETS professional oriented to less experienced KNX users. With ETS Inside, you can configure settings from your or your customer's tablet or smartphone and is perfect for small and medium sized installations. ETS Inside offers the next step in home automation in a stable and secure way. ETS Inside is smart, simple, and safe. However, what is behind those slogans and what is the real value of those? Let's go through them and see how we have considered them into our implementation, explaining them and explain what we have done and what are the benefits for the users as well as for the installers. ETS Inside is smart. How is it reflected to the software actually? ETS Inside is the first software by KNX Association for configuring KNX devices that has been designed especially for mobile devices such as tablets and smartphones, which makes the project design and commissioning easier and faster for less experienced KNX users. The ETS Inside client applications are available in the most popular mobile operating system app stores like the iOS App Store, Android App Play Store, Windows Store, as well as Huawei Store, covering almost all the needs worldwide. Furthermore, those client apps are available free of charge, so you do not have to pay additionally for them. ETS Inside operates using the server client principle. The ETS Inside server is therefore an integral part of the KNX installation where ETS Inside client connects to. Another novelty of ETS Inside is that the server part is the first Linux-based software by KNX Association to be used for smart project design and commissioning. Seeing the needs of embedded devices where ETS Inside Server can be installed to, which mostly run on Linux platforms, we emphasized on it and we made it happen, additionally, of course, to the standard Windows version for Windows 10. Summarizing some of the benefits here, we can say that you can create KNX installations with ETS inside your home or building, having the project configuration always available on site. And last, the use of ETS Inside client on any device, tablet or smartphone, either by you as installer or by your customer as end user with project configuration rights. ETS Inside is simple. I'm going to borrow a quote by William Gaddis, who said once that simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. And that's what we are striving for with ETS Inside. Simplicity for the installers and the end users when it comes to the configuration of a KNX smart home. Although KNX has been on the smart home and building market for 30 years, we can clearly see that the awareness for smart homes has considerably increased during the last 10 years. This is due to the high penetration of smartphones in our lives. People have become more familiar with the technology and with gadgets, and therefore, the homeowners do not only demand to be able to control their smart homes using their smartphones, but they also want to be able to change their configuration as well. Tasks that were in the past solely for installers and system integrators have now become shared tasks between the administrators and the end users. The installers can define the parameters to which they would like to grant access to the end user so that they are able to modify, to modify example given 
dimming values, time schedulers, light scenes, etc. And this can be done with few taps on the device parameters. Even if a project lies on an ETS inside server, the granted for changes system integrator can always, using a project password of course, get it into his ETS professional and make the necessary modifications on the installation, which can later on transfer it back to the ETS inside server available of the project. So a project can always be exchanged from ETS inside to ETS professional and vice versa, providing proving the seamless interoperability of the KNX software. In this way, an additional backup with the latest project configuration is also made available for the installer. Looking at the major benefits here, we can distinguish how easy is to create and manage a project with ETS inside. The possibility of the system integrators to allow their customers to reconfigure parts of the installation, the project exchange between ETS professional and ETS inside, and last but definitely important, the support of all KNX media, be it twisted pair, radio frequency, power line, IP, all is compatible with ETS inside. Safety and security are two of the most important aspects when it comes to information technology. At KNX, we take them really seriously, and hence we have empowered ETS Inside with some great safety features. The rule says, safety first. ETS Inside implements a triple level protection mechanism. The first level is the access restriction of the project data to those who shall actually be granted to. The second protection level is the distinction of the administrator and the end user, which allows the, uh, to restrict the end user's access to critical functions that might lower the physical, so the mechanical and electronic protection of the project. And the third and last protection level is, of course, the support of all certified KNX secure devices. So, an ETS Inside administrator may grant access to his customer for specific parameter configuration, such as timers and schedulers, scenes, etc., etc., where there is no harm when those values are changed. However, access to critical parameters such as removing the alarm integration shall be avoided since they are of a higher risk if the customer is not really familiar with KNX. KNX secure devices can be also handled by ETS inside in projects, increasing thus the protection level in a KNX installation. Looking again at the benefits here, we can indeed Note that having an ETS inside server as integral part of a KNX installation comes with increased safety characteristics that protect the project's data from unauthorized access and manipulation. And of course, KNX secure devices support as the highest level of safety. So, how to start with ETS inside on an existing or new KNX installation? There are actually eight steps to follow in order to have everything ready to operate. Let's have a closer look to them and see how quick and easy it is to create and commission a KNX installation. The first step is to integrate the ETS Insight server to the actual KNX installation. How to do that? Download and install the ETS Insight server on a computer example given a Raspberry Pi, a mini computer with Windows 10, a desktop computer, etc. Or purchase a device with ETS Inside Server pre-installed. What is important here to highlight is that ETS Inside Server is not only available for Windows 10, but also for Linux, being the first commercial software by KNX Association, which is Linux-based. 
Once the ATS Inside server is installed, connect it to the KNX installation via a KNX IP or a KNX USB interface and start. Step number two is to install the necessary ETS Inside client, which depends on the handheld tab you're going to use. Smartphones, tablets, and desktop computers are supported. Go to the respective app store of the operating system, find and install the ETS Inside client, which is free of charge. Once installed, you're able to get started with the design and the commissioning of your KNX installation. Now, in step number three, you have to open the ETS Inside client app and select the ETS Inside server, which should normally be found in the found connections. If for any reason it's not automatically shown, then you can always enter its IP address manually by tapping the manual tab. After you have been connected to the respective ETS Inside server via your ETS Inside client, you will be asked to create a new password if it's the first time. If not, then you have to enter your administrator password. Depending on the user type, ETS Inside allows you to log in as following. Administrator, full access to the whole installation, and customer, only access to priorly enabled functions by the administrator. Once the correct password is entered, then you will see the ETS Inside dashboard. Now you can create a new project, or if you have transferred the project from ETS Professional, you can open it by uh, tapping the open button from the main toolbar or select the highlighted project, uh, which is highlighted with green actually, which will then open the project and allow you to create the structure of your building in ETS Inside. You can create rooms, floors, cabinets, etc., so that the real building structure is reflected in your project. Once the building structure is set, then you have to add the devices in the corresponding location by using the online catalog, which contains all the KNX certified devices that are in the market and are compatible with ETS inside. At last, since all devices have now been properly allocated, you can now start linking the building functions with the respective device channels. Once the configuration is ready, download it to the devices and you're ready to go. ETS Inside has all what is needed to set up a KNX installation with only a few taps on the screen. ETS Inside versus ETS Professional, a quick comparison between our configuration software to clearly identify their scope and their position in the market. And here we are. On this table, we can easily see that ETS Inside is a tool oriented for less experienced KNX users, be it system integrators who just started their career or homeowners who would like to make modifications on their smart home. Furthermore, it's best suited for small or medium sized projects where the configuration can be done quickly with a handheld. What is also important is the fact that an ETS Inside server can only host one project at a time, whereas ETS Professional can host unlimited number of projects since it's for professional use. By that, I would like to close my ETS Inside presentation. Thank you very much for your attendance and I wish you a great day